If you love someone, that is from the same gender, of course, huh? When the, all the brothers are taking their cell phones. Okay, it's Valentine's Day, you know, I'm late, but we, still we can't catch up. No. If you love someone of the same gender, a brother loves a brother, a sister loves a sister, in the Islamic sense, not in the LGBTQIXYZ sense, all the alphabets. No, I'm talking about pure love, brotherly love, uh, uh, platonic love, oh, I don't know what you call it, but I love the brother for the sake of Allah. This love is not uh, uh, something that is weird. When we were young, we, you, you don't say, I love the brother. You say, I like the brother. Why? So no, 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 love is a taboo. If you say, I love the brother, then there's, this was like 40 years ago, 50 years ago, they used to teach this, this when we used to speak in English. Nowadays, we all got out of the closet, alhamdulillah. <laughs> now we have wardrobes, we have cupboards with no closets. It's all banned in our Muslim homes. So, it is part of the sunnah to express your love to your brother. The Prophet says, alayhi salatu wasalam, in an authentic hadith, when you love someone, if you love your brother, you must notify him. And I make Allah my witness. I love you all for the sake of Allah. I don't know you. And this is a general yani, testimony. But I love you because you're Muslims and you are struggling in a kafir country. and You're striving to observe your Islam, cement your Iman and come to have this bond with your brothers. Why wouldn't I love you? I love you for the sake of Allah and I know you love me back. And if you don't, who cares? <laughs> I don't care. So, if you love someone, reach out. This is not AT&T. If you love someone, reach out and tell them that you love them because this is an Islamic etiquette. The Prophet ﷺ was with his companion and he said, O Prophet of Allah, you see that man walking? By Allah, I love him for the sake of Allah. So the Prophet said to him, did you notify him? The man said, no. He said, go ahead and do it. So the man went to him and said to him, I love you for the sake of Allah. And the man said, may Allah loves you for whom his, uh, you love me for his sake. And this is the Islamic way of sharing your emotions. It's sad when we know one another for 10, 20 years. Ah, what's happening? What's doing? What, how are you doing? That's it. And we have this love towards one another. Yaqi, show it, express it. And it's even sadder when you're married for 30 years to your wife and you fail to say this miserably.